Y'all, I just went and filmed an entire intro without recording. Hello and welcome back to Overbooked, I'm Amanda. And today we're gonna be doing a reading vlog. Well, this weekend we'll be doing a reading vlog. I have a three day weekend, so I'm gonna be trying to do a total of 24 hours of reading or a 24 hour reading vlog. We'll see if I can do it. A couple of the books, there's three books that I would really like to focus on and potentially finish this weekend. The main one being The Song of Solomon by Toni Morrison. Um, I've been reading this all month. I really like it, but it's actually really hard and slow to get through. So um, I really want to get through that one. And then I've started Wow No Thank You by Samantha Irby. And I'm reading this for my workbook club. I've really enjoyed what I've read so far. It's barely been anything, but like it. And then the other one is Butter Honey Pig Bread. Oh my God. Butter Honey Pig Bread uh, by Francisca Ezwa Iwaza. Wazzy. I checked this out for the Book of Sense book club. I'm also reading on audio, or yeah, I'm also listening to Mediocre on Libby, and that is for, said by Jess, which I think her YouTube channel is just Jess Owens. I think I've mis said that before, but she has a nonfiction book club, called, um, and they're reading Mediocre this month, and I'm really excited to join that or just follow along because one of my goals this year is to read more nonfiction. So, I'm very excited about that. And then some other books that may make the cut, I doubt it, would be The Mercies. I'm reading this with my friend Rachel, so I'll definitely have to give her a heads up if I get close to getting to this one. And then A Little Devil in America, which Tracy from the Sacks recommended, or it was her book club pick for December, but I've seen a ton of people other than Tracy read this and rave about it, so I'm really excited. But like I said, mainly gonna be focusing on these books. Uh, mainly focusing on these books and yeah, I'm excited. Hello, it's Saturday. Hi. So last night, I did not read actually that much. I probably read maybe a total of 20 minutes, and that's what we're gonna give myself for the 24 hour reading vlog, is 20 minutes. Chandler and I went out to eat, and it was really good, tasty, and then we came home, and one of our streamers that we like to watch, who always streams like three times a week, was on last night, and it was just too funny to not watch. So, um, I did that instead. <laughs> but I am up, and it is 8.30 and I think I'm gonna try to read until 10 o'clock and then I'm gonna go run and then I have to get ready to go over to a friend's house. So I have a plan that we're gonna track all of our reading on this whiteboard that I stole from my work. I am gonna put down the periods of time that I read and then we're gonna add them up. So let me put you guys down. We have this whiteboard over here. Whiteboard, also pajamas. Anyways, so let's let's write on this thing. You can't really see me, but is that really a problem at this time of the morning? What if I go down like this? Also, the lighting is terrible. Oh well. So 24 hours. 24 hours of reading. Okay. Friday. Okay, so this is where we're at right now. Total 20 minutes. <laughs> We've got a ways to go. Honestly, realistically, I was thinking about this. I don't know if I can really achieve 24 hours of reading this weekend, but hey, let's try.
Hello. Went for my run and took a shower. And then I read a little bit. Um, so we have, I've updated our little board. I think I might, <laughs> I might tonight at some point redo this board so it's more pretty for a thumbnail or something. <laughs> so, cause right now I feel like I'm gonna run out of room real quick. Maybe I'll do it this way or something. But so I read about for about 30 minutes listening to Mediocre. Uh, I got to 32% of the book. So that's cool. And then I just sat down here from starting at 11.30 and now it's noon. So about 30 minutes of the Song of Solomon. And I got to page 248 and I left off at page 226. So trying to track all of that. Oh, I wrote 226 on the wrong line. I did. But yeah, so we got pretty far. I think uh, right now I'm going to get ready to go to my friend's house. So I'm just going to like brush my teeth, put on some clothes other than my dad's old ratty sweatshirt. And yeah, uh, but I think I'm gonna listen to Mediocre in the car, which will give me about like maybe 30, 40 minutes of reading to add to this. But I think on the way home, I'm gonna call my parents. So missing out on some reading time there, but probably should give them a call. So let's see, let's total this up. So we're at two hours and 40 minutes. So <laughs> got a ways to go to 24 hours. I'm back home. We did it. Uh, I went and had lunch with my friend, had some conversation, hung out. It was really nice. Haven't seen her in a bit. So it was really good to catch up. But I'm back. So I'm going to do put these dry clothes away. And then I'm going to do another um, reading sprint thing. Um, I did listen to Mediocre on the way there. So I got like 40 minutes of that of reading done there. And then I called my mom on the way home because I haven't talked to her in a bit, so I did that. So I missed on some reading opportunity there, but um, it is almost 6.30, so not a ton of time <laughs> left today <laughs> to get some significant reading done, but I think that's all I'm gonna try to do for the rest of the evening is read. So um, let's get these clothes put away and then we'll read, yay. Okay, so I just finished Song of Solomon and wow. So I'm not gonna lie, the first like half of this book was pretty slow for me. I didn't understand what was going on, but the second half, like I felt like we were trying to solve a mystery and like connect all of Melkin's family ties. And I was like, I don't know, I was really hooked. And so I'm glad that I finished it. I'm so excited. I don't know at what point I'm gonna try to read or listen to um, Tracy from the Stacks podcast episode on this book, probably soon. But if I wanna try to get to 24 hours this weekend, not sure if that will happen. So I have to do the board. Look at that. So maybe I should do the total. Hang on. So we're at four hours and 50 minutes. And uh, that means we have about 20 hours to go. <laughs> I just learned I won't be doing a ton of reading tomorrow. So I'm trying to decide. I just, I don't know. I just, you know, I just spent so much time reading a physical book. Like, do I just want to chill with some Stardew and then listen to my audiobook, Mediocre, right now? That might be good. Maybe I'll do that for like an hour and then go to bed. So I think I'll fire up old switch and start playing some stardew and listen to mediocre sounds good to me all right hello it is sunday and chandler and i just looked at some houses um pretty good pretty good tours i don't know nothing nothing that's pretty good tours <laughs> we didn't really like any of the houses but pretty good i don't know what i mean <laughs> Uh, now we're gonna go hang out with some friends and watch some football, play some Mario Kart. So 24 hour reading vlog will have to continue later. Last night I did get two hours of mediocre done. So that adds to the total we had totaled yesterday. Words are hard. Um, was four hours and 50 minutes. And so that's six hours and 50 minutes. So we'll have to do a, a lot of work tomorrow, maybe tonight. But we'll get there. <sighs> oh my god, this lighting is so pretty. Taylor, what are you gonna read? Um. Ah. I okay. Got <laughs>
Hello, this vlog is going horrible. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, <laughs> not that, it, well, it is kind of going horrible because I'm terrible at vlogging, but the 24 hour reading is just not gonna happen. So we, we'll try this again, but we'll see how much we can actually read today. But <laughs> total, I think we got maybe to almost seven hours and it's Sunday today. It's the last day of the weekend and I wasted my entire morning editing a video and also playing Stardew Valley. It was worth it, I'd say. 24 hours of reading is not gonna be done in this vlog, but we will try again. I liked the whiteboard. I'm probably gonna have to do it another weekend where I just don't have as much stuff going on and I just stay home and read. But um, it is, it's still Sunday, it's four o'clock, and I think my goal today is to get to 50% through of Wow No Thank You and potentially finish Mediocre. So I got pretty far when I was at the gym today. I got to like almost 70%. So I think I'm gonna get to 50% of Wow No Thank You and then just play Stardew Valley and listen to Mediocre. That's my kind of Sunday. Let's read. Hi, hello. This is a very late check-in. The weekend is done. It's been done. Um, it's Tuesday night. It's almost 10 o'clock. Um, but I got 50% through. Wow, no, thank you. So we did it. And this is the end of this vlog. This 24-hour reading vlog. This lie that I sold to you. I'm sorry. Um, I will try again. I will definitely try again because that was fun in theory. And I like the whiteboard. I don't know what it is, you guys. But like planners, a fucking whiteboard. I'm on top of that shit. I love it. When there's actually a weekend, that's nothing's going on. I'm gonna attempt the 24 reading, the 24 hour reading vlog, and we're we're gonna do it. So I'm excited about it. But this is just not it. This was not the time, <laughs> and it was not the weekend. But I am happy because I finally finished Song of Solomon. I got really far in mediocre, and I got far on this book. So I'm loving it. Made some progress, and I'm liking it. So I hope you enjoyed following along. If you did, hit that like button. It's fun. Hit it. Just thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you guys next time.